Hey guys and welcome to this new video and in this new video I'm going to be doing a CD collection. Um, I know a lot of people want me to do a vinyl collection but honestly I have over 300 records so it's going to be a very long video and I'm not really sure how to show that off so I, I'd rather just do my CD collection. Um, I really don't collect CDs that much that often anymore. I mostly focus on records but I do have a couple of old beat up um, CDs. They're not in the great greatest condition, but I do also have some newer CDs as well. So I thought I'd show you, show you guys these. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, my CDs are organized in any way, like my vinyl, my records are organized alphabetically, and my CDs, I just store them in random, random order. So let's just start off. Um, I have five seconds of summer. She looks so perfect. EP, and this shit is broken. <laughs> but yeah, I have that inside there. Um, there's that. <laughs> I have Alana Dray, Born to Die, and this is just the standard edition or deluxe. I'm not really sure to be honest. I then have the. Um, Ariana Grande the remix and this is an import from Japan um, so I do have that there I really like this because I like the cover a lot but it does include some nice remixes um, but I'm only just got it because I love the cover I'm not gonna lie and then I have Harry Styles um, debut album Harry Styles I have um, one edition of so this is reputation um, that comes in a case like this um, and it comes with a poster and stuff um, and then I also have two more copies of reputation but these are the soft um, packs um, that you get inside the reputation magazine cover from Target then I have Troy Sivan um, debut EP um, which I really glad I owned this in my collection. I wish it was pressed on vinyl because I really, really enjoyed the tracks on this record. Then I have Charlie XAX True Romance, Halsey Room 93 EP, which this is an amazing EP. I love this a lot. And then I have two copies of Conan Gray um, Sunset Thieves. Season, yeah, sunset season. Um, I got to because I went to see him on tour and I bought two tickets. So, yeah. Then I have Azalea Banks Ice Colors um, Change. Um, Icy Color Change. There we go. And then I have um, one edition of Billie Eilish. When we all fall asleep, where do we go? Sorry. Yeah, when we all fall asleep, where do we go? And. This is the deluxe mm, box CD thingy, one of them. Um, you just get some photos, some tattoos, some stickers, and obviously the CD inside there somewhere. I don't know, but yeah, that's that part. Then I have the regular edition right here. Um, yeah, just normal version. And I also own the Japanese edition as well, which is cool. And I have a sealed copy, another sealed copy, and I also have the Target exclusive, which is sealed, and I have another copy, which is actually open from Target, um, which is just, you know, some stickers and tattoos and a poster. I have Two copies of Thank You Next by Ariana Grande. I have choice of two copies of Choice of Honor um, Bloom. I bought concert tickets to him and I got two copies. Um, Demi Lovato, don't forget. Demi Lovato, um, Tell Me You Love Me, and this is signed by her, as you guys can see. And I have another copy of that. Continuing on, I have the Deluxe Edition right here. A sealed copy, another sealed copy, um, two sealed copies of the Target exclusive, which is two extra songs, which are uh, Smoke and Mirrors and Ready For Ya. A sealed copy, 
Deluxe. The reason I have so much copies of Tell Me You Love Me is I just wanted to support her. Um, there wasn't a real excuse for that, um, you know. Uh, but moving on, I have Marina the Diamonds, Paramount. Uh, I can't pronounce the book, but I have this one. I love Marina. I have the single for We Can't Stop by Miley Cyrus and Mega Trainer, thank you. Moving on, I have Lana Del Rey, Ultraviolence, Paramore, Self-Title, One Direction, Midnight Memories, The Chainsmokers, Memories Do Not Open, a still copy of The Mobile Don't Forget, But Still Bad Blood, Lore Pure Heroine, um, Arctic Monkeys AM, as you can tell, this thing is beat up as fuck. I don't know what happened there. I don't know. Um, I had the limited edition, Japanese edition of Billie Eilish, um, Don't Smile At Me, which this one is kind of cool because this mm, comes with a thing where you can make it into a, a stand, but I don't know how to do that, so I just have it there. I then have Troy Sivan Wild EP, Poppy That Computer um, on CD, which I think is rare now. Um, not really sure about it, but I like the packaging. I have a single of New Rose by Dua Lipa, two copies of Ariana Grande Sweetener, Lana Del Rey Born to Die, and this one's just a standard edition. Demi Lovato Unbroken, Hazy Balance. Um, Demi Lovato Confident, Lana Del Rey Lust for Life, and I think this is the Target exclusive. And then I have six copies of Witness by Katy Perry. And the reason I have this much copies of Witness is because I bought it on eBay and they were selling it like six, six copies for five dollars. And I'm buying it and six of them pop up so. That was a steal. Um, and also I love Katy Perry Witness. A lot of people don't like it, but I really enjoyed this album. It's really good, so yeah. Moving on, I have two copies of the single For Me by Taylor Swift. And the reason I have this much copies is because each of them came with a signed booklet of Lover, which I have here. As you can see, it, it come with four booklets, which I have all of them right here. Um, inside here that one is inside but I don't have them there where do I have them but anyways here's one copy of the signed booklet of lover by Terry Swift I do have three more that are signed I don't know where I kept them actually I do but I don't know where they're at oh I found it hold on making a mess but um here's the other two copies of me Actually, where do I have them at? I have them somewhere, but I'm not really sure where they're at. But if I find them later, I will show you guys. Anyways, I have that. And then I have Lost for Life by, I mean, not Lost for Life, Norman Falcon Rockwell, Lana Del Rey. And I have a signed copy of Camila self-title album, Camila. Um, oh, here's one version, another version of me. Do I have them inside here? No. Anyway, there's that. And then I have another copy of me, which is the Billboard Music Awards. I have Manny Trainer title EP, and I also have Manny Trainer title the album. Lord, um, Drama, Charlie XCX, Sucker, and Charlie XCX Break the Rules Ghoulies Edition. I have Melanie Martinez Crybaby and uh, Selena Gomez Revival. Demi Lovato single for um, Echamela Cupa featuring Louis Fonsi. Katy Perry Chain to the Rhythm CD single. Um, Demi Lovato Here We Go Again. Molly Cyrus um, Name Her Now. A copy of Kesha Rainbow, um, a different copy of Mila Martinez Crybaby, and this is a DJ pack which is also signed by Mila Martinez. 
and I have Bridget Miller um, Nemesis which is also signed by Bridget Miller as you guys can see and I wish it was pressed on vinyl because I really really love this CP it's really great if you guys haven't listened to it definitely check it out because it's pretty cool moving on I have Iggy Azalea in my defense uh, which is signed by Iggy as you guys can see right there I have Poppy and my girl, which is Amber Poppy, which I bought off her merch stand at her concert. And then I have Halsey Manic, um, which is signed by her. Another copy of Manic by Halsey. Selena Gomez on um, Rare, which is signed by Selena Gomez. Um, I have one copy, wait, actually, I have three copies of Boyfriend. Um, the single by Ariana Grande. Um, the reason I have three is because I bought one before and then they released um, two more versions which came with these two cards. So I bought one for Ariana Grande and one for a dog. So they released another one if it contains Ultra House on them, but I really don't care for them, so I didn't buy that. Um, I have the Charlie Angels Don't Call Me Angel by Irina Grande, Molly Ferris, and Lana Del Rey on CD as well. I have Five Seconds of Summer Teeth um, single CD. Um, I have Senorita with Sean Mendes and Camila Cabello single CD. And with this one, I also have the. I also have the box set kind of thing that they came out with, which you guys can't see. Um, they just come with a huge poster really, and this CD is right there. But I think it's pretty cool though. Um, I like this photo a lot. So I also came with that. Um, well, I didn't came with it, you had to buy it separately, but I bought that too. And then I have um, Rex Orange County pony two copies of that are sealed by Mano Martinez K-12 and these are the DVD film versions which I have an open one right here and I really like this so yeah and then I have another copy of K-12 but this one is the jewel case edition and I have a sealed copy of that as well and I have another copy of Norma Franco Rockwell but this one has the uncensored version on the cover there so yeah and I have three copies of If I Can't Have You by Shawn Mendes these are all different um, single edition this one is the blue one this one is the orange one and this is the pink one I think or something like that you really can't tell by the you kind of tell by the covers which version they are they're like slightly different but yeah, that's all the CDs that I own and I hope you guys um, enjoyed this video. I do plan on doing a final collection video sometime this year, but it might take a while, a couple months. Because I want to buy a new camera to film that and um, again, that video is going to take forever to film because I do have over 300 records. Um, so probably gonna take a while um but i also have a couple of cassettes um but i don't know, I don't know if you guys want that because i don't have that many i have about 20 um but let me know if you guys want to see a cassette collection as well and i'll film that for you guys um and yeah that's everything um thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys later bye guys